Happy Friday! Happy Friday, YouTubers! It is Friday, everybody's favorite day of the week. If you work Monday to Friday, uh, just want to send shout outs to everybody. So, social media is, is seeing huge movements in social media. Okay, so I'm on BitChute. I've been up, uploading to BitChute, right? Right. Sandman, you know Sandman, the, the godfather, the founding father of uh, uh, MGTOW, M-G-T-O-W? He actually messaged one of my videos, commented, he says, Hey Mike, it's so good to see you here on BitChute. I was like, wow. And then uh, I wrote back to him on, 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 on his YouTube channel. I said, yeah, you know, YouTube, because he did a video about that too, right? And I said, you know what? YouTube, uh, uh, BitChute, I got nine subs and I've been there for three days. And having nine subs in three days on BitChute or on any on, on any platform, because we're so used to the YouTube platform, right, is a big deal for me. Because for me to get to 10 subs when I started my channel, it took like six months to a year to get six subscri uh, 10 subscribers, right? So it takes a while uh, because YouTube really doesn't want to get anything new out there without really knowing what they're you know, getting out there, right? So, heavy duty censorship. I remember when YouTube is YouTube broadcast yourself. Now it's not that anymore. It's, it's it's them tube, and it's what they want. So, anyway, so okay. Oh, it's so cool. I want to thank everyone that get went on Patreon too. I have four people on Patreon donating to this uh, cause here and keeping this um, this going, which I'm very happy for and really grateful. I'm gonna have to learn how to reply, or I'm gonna have to learn how to contact my Patreon members and, and, and thank them independently too. And on Patreon, you know what's so cool what they did? I set up discourse, like a, a chat room, and I set it up like it's kind of cute. What I did was to kind of go against the, the grain, um, I set up um, uh, Patreon. It's kind of cool what I did. I took like mob family levels. So if you want to buy me a coffee, it's the first entry. It's a dollar. So you could buy me a coffee, right? And uh, it's a dollar a month. And it's coffee and it says, welcome to the family. Then the second is soldier, okay? And that's uh, uh, $5 a month. And then $10 a month is is um, after after captain. Uh, it's $10, uh, $5 for captain and $10 for consigliere, which is... Um, the one after and the, and the f mob family and then there's underboss right so underboss is 25 but no one's gonna get that I only put 25 positions available for for underboss so um, I, I, I set that up there too that was really nice it's cute it's kind of like an organized uh, mob family that we have but it's it's kind of kind of like a rebel way of showing going against the grain. I was going to do pirates. I was going to set uh, my Patreon up with pirates where you get promoted from swab to mate. And I can promote people internally in the chat rooms too. People that are that are there, that are, you know, that are uh, consistently uh, uh, sending show tips and stuff and discussion. Because it's going to get a point where we can't post on, on anywhere. So we're going to have to find these underground speakeasies. So I want to call it like "Welcome to the Speakeasy." So it's we're all like like a crime family that's discussing current affairs that we should be able to anyway. You know, it's kind of like I set it up kind of cool. Go check out my Patreon, guys. Uh, it's nice. I, I'm just tinkering with it and playing with it. And the chat room is going to take a little while. It's set up uh, for for it to gain traction because people are just going to get sick and tired posting on Facebook and getting flagged, posting on here, and getting flagged. Go on Minds.com. Everybody's on there too. Oh man, it's so good to see everybody again. They got banned from uh, Facebook and uh, and from YouTube. It's so good to see them again. You know. So yeah, I'm 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 happy, guys. I'm really happy that there is an ends to. But we'll see what happens with these sites. I'm gonna go to D Live. Someone's telling me to go to D Live too to stream, so I can do multicasting, so I don't have to stick to uh, I don't have to stick forever to. Uh, YouTube for live streaming. So YouTube shot itself in the foot. YouTube is basically going to lose a, a ton of revenue because the people that actually watch the videos that matter aren't going to be there anymore. So you know what I'm saying? And then Facebook. Oh, you got you got a you got a Facebook prison. You got that cool oh, Facebook prison. Facebook will go straight to hell. I don't give a rat's penis. Don't care, Facebook. Facebook.
Facebook. We're going to go Facebook. Facebook's going to hell. Anyways, crook book. So, yeah, anyways, so I wanted to share that. If you guys want to buy me a coffee, you guys go ahead and then um, find a way how to um, message you people. I'm going to try my best and thank everybody for being part of the family. You know what I'm saying? Let me know if that's a good... Go look at it. Let me know. It's on top. Go on top of my page. Uh, I'll leave a link below. But go on top of my page. You'll see a Patreon. Let me know if that's cute. I, I did it. Like, I could have done pirates. Like, swap to mates. Then then from swap to mate is, uh, I think, I don't, I don't know if it's uh, it, it's it's uh, first first man and then or first mate or uh, the second mate. I don't know. Second mate, then first mate. I, I don't know how it works on a pirate ship. I didn't look it up. I did the mafia one because it looks pretty cool. And it goes against uh, what, you know, it goes against the grain type of thing, you know. Anyways, guys, oil is looking like it's uh, getting a little bit of bullish. I'm looking, uh, I'm seeing a little bit of strength in the Canadian dollar right now because they're expected to cut rates uh, or lower rates. So you're seeing a little bit of um, um, strength in the Canadian dollar this morning. Australian dollar is kind of plateauing. It's in, I think it was 69 cents still. Australian dollar is, is taking a huge beating. They lowered rates. And uh, if Canada follows suit and the UK, well, UK is at like 0%. I think Europe is in negative interest rates right now. So uh, where things are sitting right now, it looks like every, every, um, every economy needs to kind of catch up with each other and take each other to the next level. So, um, yeah, it's going to be interesting, an interesting sight to see where things are going to be headed. So, okay, so I'm going to have to wait for all these people to leave with their vehicles. Entitled coasters here at the Tim Hortons, severely entitled people renegotiating the rules as they go along. Oh, yeah. Good morning, people. It is Friday. It is oh, it's so nice outside. It's gorgeous. I think it's 19 Celsius, but it's beautiful. It's oh, oh man. Yeah, and and then on on thing you can message me direct. Uh, you can message me the, directly on Minds, but I just don't get really get notifications for Minds. Patreon's right there when it comes to taking care of my. Uh, our following and our, our what we got going on. So the Discord's going to be nice. Discord's nice. It's the chat in the Patreon so we could all kind of uh, have a nice little rankings. It's cute. It's cute is what it is. It's it's but it gets serious. Give it a couple of years if I'm still do if I'm still making videos for you guys. You guys will see what I'm talking about. You guys will see what I'm talking about. And I got four followers on Patreon now. I'm so happy. I feel I feel like like, you know, everything's got a reason, right? And um, and my wife supports me a gazillion percent. Um, I, I spoke to a friend of mine. I said, you know what, dude? Are you going to be, um, you know, I really want to do a YouTube channel like you. I really want to. So do it. Oh, no. My wife says, oh, those guys are all losers that are on there. Nobody listens to them. They make fun of them. And they're, they're, they're a bunch of losers. And, you know, the 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 the, 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 the you know. They, they all they broadcast their problems and blah 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 and it's like yeah no my wife is like yeah uh, hun I'm uh, she came into my room she came into the room this morning like really early after she left uh, to take care of the baby she's like oh I'm gonna plug your phone in because you have to make a video this morning I'm like thank you my princess you know oh the best wife in the world you know can't ask for more man seriously I can't. Hola, buenos dias. Can I get uh, extra large dark roast one cream? For sure, anything else? No, thank you. Okay, it's 2 Okay, thank you. Yeah, I like to go with the long, the long intros in Spanish. Uh, long intros in Spanish is, Hola, buenos dias, felicidades, como estas, que tal? That's my favorite one. You just go on for like 11 minutes <laughs> greeting somebody. <laughs> I like it. It's formal. 
Yeah, anyways, yeah, I got lots going on today, guys. It's Friday. The store's going to be slammed. I got a couple of people visiting. Not enough people visiting. Uh, there's a couple of people that might visit me today at the shop to say hi and s sit down and speak with me. I might do a meet and greet with Mike at the shop, maybe a specific day, maybe uh, towards the end of summer where everybody gets together, hangs out. Hola, buenos dias, como estas, que tal? Funny. <laughs> <laughs> You're using another language. Yes, right? I know, I know. Thank you, my brother. Are you only Oh, no, that's bad words. That's Portuguese. <laughs> Bye. Bye, yeah. Portuguese in there, a little bit of mix of everything. Oh man. Yeah, a lot of people don't know Portuguese is my first language, right? Yeah, you know, the whole thing about um, the markets where they're heading, they're gonna balance out eventually, guys. Give it time, you'll see. You're gonna see a nice balance in the markets. Um, coming, you're, you're going to see a little, you're going to go a little bit of a bear market for a bit until things level out. There will be a balance in the markets at what cost? Our futures. Because they're not pushing the reset button and that's the problem and that's what I'm scared of, you know? Pull the, push the damn button. I'm even invested in, in, in the dividend stocks. I don't care. Push the button. Let's go. Let's get people back on track. So many lives have been displaced. So much homelessness. So much drugs. Fentanyl coming in from China. And in return, the money gets uh, laundered into Canada through uh, real estate. It's disgusting. It is disgusting. I wonder in Australia, if you're watching me from down under, if you guys have like an opioid problem or is it fentanyl or is it a cocaine problem like what is the biggest drug there in the down under because I know in New Zealand was meth because they were meth testing homes there and the black mold and all that crap with the housing um, um, disaster down in New Zealand but what's going on with there like in in, 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 in Australia it was the like the, the, the go-to drug you know because when I was in Miami uh, every, every like you know how everyone smokes pot in BC Everyone did cocaine in Miami. So it was like, every, like different parts of the world have different uh, types of, I guess, more popular or easy to get to type drugs. It's like everyone's like, well, you don't do drugs? I'm like, no. I didn't even dabble or, or even experiment. Well, experiment what? Experiment killing myself? Like, I don't think so, man. You know, I, th I put drugs and pharmaceuticals, uh, pharmaceuticals and, and, and some of the hard drugs all on the same level too, you know? People are like, you don't take meds, you're crazy, dude. I know I'm crazy and I love it. I'm crazy and I love it. But, um, yeah, you know, I'm just uh, really, really grateful, you know, that... Uh, there's, a, there's still people that care out there. There's still a community of people out there. There's still people that that want to see a change, right? But we're dwindling. We, we are dying off, you know? We're, we're obviously, a majority of us are older because we lived through the good times. So we're dying off, and that's the scary part. I'm scared of us dying off. I'm not scared of dying, but I'm scared of us dying off and not leaving the message because if it's electronic, it could always be altered and changed. That's a, a modern-day book burning, right? And that modern day book burning, I think, is um, something that um, we need to look at. Something that we should take very serious, right? I go on, on YouTube and go on YouTube at, at just just for just just to just to be like you know observant of things. Go to YouTube if you want to have a laugh. Go to trending what's hot oh my god it's all swearing hey what the fuck hey man what the fuck hey man what's the mother of this like what is this this is trending and every video has a mix of different cultures and everything's like perfectly staged it's like that's why they want to get rid of bad actors like me bad actors like me are the ones that that are not good we're not good we're not good for society we're not uh, good for even though I'm probably more multicultural than like 97% of the rest of the planet. I speak a bunch of languages. My ex-wife was Muslim. I'm famous in Africa. I'm very famous in Africa. Whew. I put up a political post the other day on my fan page. Oh, the amount of backlash I got. 
It, the, the, the post, I took it down. It was bad. It wasn't a bad post. It's just, I'm just kind of waking people up at the political backlash I got on there. It had, I think it had it just reached a thousand comments on it. And then a lot of it was negative and people bashing each other. I'm like, oh man, I gotta, I gotta calm down. I gotta take this down. And I took it down and then I did a reprieve post saying it was a social experiment and people need to understand that politics, it, the way to get through politics is by speaking, not by violently trashing each other and, and threatening each other. Wow. So I had to kind of take care of that if that, if that makes any sense to you guys. But, um, yeah. Oh, it's my friend. She's uh, part of the Filipino food uh, uh, mart here. My wife's creating a Filipino group to meet up here at the store after I close on maybe a specific day of the week. I told her to do Wednesdays because Wednesdays is to do trends in the housing market. And it's easier. But she's uh, she's one of the first Filipinos to immigrate here to Merit back in 19... I think it was 71. So, yeah, she's seen this town go through a lot. Anyways, guys... If you want to buy me a coffee, go on Patreon, join the family, and I'm going to try and see if I could figure that out, how the whole uh, chat chat should be working. So if you if you are, I think I have two uh, 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 captains, two captains. So we got two captains, and we have, I think, one soldier, I think. I'm going to go check. Uh, no, two captains and two soldiers, I think. So... Can you go into the chat area uh, if you are uh, on Patreon and you are supporting and you are like the two captains and the two soldiers? Try and see if you can get on your chats. There's different chat levels. But the higher the level, all the chats you could see, right? So I think it's interesting. I think it's cool. Anyways, let me know what you guys think. Comment below. Thanks for watching and uh, happy Friday to everybody.